Alrighty folks, so my name is Jaron. I'm going to be your tour guide for this tour of Crystal Cave. Okay, I'm Jim DeLong. I'm the manager and part owner of Crystal Cave. Um, actually, my grandfather, another gentleman, bought it in 1923. And I came 20 years ago when they were looking for somebody to be the manager. Now, when the farmers first discovered the cave in 1871, they thought they had actually discovered maybe diamonds or something of great value they could sell and have a nice early retirement. A couple of uh, months after the farmers found the cave, Mr. Samuel Kohler bought the cave from them and turned it into an attraction for tourists. And so that piece was cut off and buried in his grave in 1912 when he passed on. I don't feel odd telling him that, but you definitely get strange looks when you say, like, what is it, a cave? Like, you mean a cave underground? I'm like, yeah, what are you, a caveman? Well, I think there's very few caves around, so that's one thing. You know, not too many people get to see a cave, you know, especially like in Jersey. This is the only formation in the entire cave, then, that we actually allow people to touch if they want to. This is where our family of 30 to 40 North American brown bats sleep throughout the day. Yeah, it is a living, growing cave. I wouldn't say it eroded, but it is growing. You don't see it in our lifetime because it grows at such a slow rate, but. On the bottom, one easy way to remember which one is which is that the stalactite hangs tightly to the ceiling and a stalag might, you might trip over it as it grows. Well, we look at safety very seriously, and we do have um, netting and uh, some, some fencing. You know, it, it's damp in there, so it can get slippery, you know, depending on the shoes you wear. The side of the face here of Jack Frost, with his icy cold breath freezing up against the cave there, keeping the cave a cold 54 degrees in the hot months of the year. But I just remember that the cave seemed so huge at that time, and now they work here, you know. It, it's, it's not very big cave at all, but it just seems so much bigger when you're little as to when you're an adult. 